What's up everybody? It's your boy is Solo Thoughts. In today's video, we're going to be reacting to a woman saying a man has to work seven jobs and have two side hustles to buy the things that I want. Delusional. But I'm going to jump straight into the video for y'all and then I'm going to come back and give my reaction. Let's get it. Solo Thoughts. My dad always made a way. So I feel like a man should always make a way. I feel like I'm not going to work my hands to the to the bones to provide. I'm not going to work 16 to 20 hours a day or a week to provide for my family. You're the man. You have the penis. Go get a job. Get three jobs. My man has two jobs. Go get seven jobs and two side hustles to buy me the things that I want because I'm a woman. That sounds stupid. Before I go in, I will say I do agree with her saying the man should be the provider. The man should be the breadwinner of the household. Of course. But woman, you are out of your mind. You said the man needs to work seven jobs and have two side hustles to buy the things you want. See, when I heard you say to buy the things you want, I'm like, oh, yeah. She don't care about the type of person you are. She care about them commas in your bank account. She care about them $100 bills in your wallet. She don't care about you. And a lot of y'all men need to wake up and see this. These are the type of women you want to avoid at all costs because they don't want you for you. They want your money. And when you're in a relationship and the woman wants your money, it's time to go. It's time to go, bro, because you're going to be miserable. Who wants to be in a relationship where a person only cares about what you have in your pocket or in your bank? That's not a relationship. If you want that woman, go get you a sugar daddy because that's not cool. And another thing is you want him working all these hours. How is he going to spend time with you? That's how I know you in it for the money. And it's sad. And I hate to think like this, but most of the women of today are like this. All they care about is your money. They don't care about you. They don't care about your feelings. It's about me, 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 me. Run. Do not get in a relationship with these type of women. These women are narcissists. These women are manipulators. They got you in a chokehold. When you get to that level where they got you in a chokehold, it's time to go. Because you're going to get your feelings hurt. You're going to never want to be in a relationship again. Men, y'all got to stop being betas. Y'all got to stop being simps. Just because she has a nice body, just because she has a pretty face, does not mean you have to fall for everything she tell you. No, start being a man. Be dominant like you're supposed to, your natural role. Y'all simping down because these women have nice bodies and pretty faces. No, that's not what you're supposed to do. Y'all got to get it together. I don't understand how these women could be so bad. And I don't hate women. So I don't want you women watching this video to think that I hate women. I don't. It's just so sad because I feel like y'all could do so much better. That's why a lot of men are choosing to be single. Because y'all like this. Y'all make it hard to want to get to know you. Whatever happened to getting to know somebody? Whatever happened to talking about each other's goals and dreams? Like, y'all don't even care about that no more. Y'all care about money. That's the number one thing for y'all. Money, 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 money. You on OnlyFans. Having men buy your services. Having men pay for subscriptions to see you half naked. How are you a prize? How are you a 10? You call yourself a dime? That's not a dime. A woman that's low key, out the way, handle her business. She not on Instagram, half naked, twerking, doing all this extra unnecessary stuff. She's focused on her career. She's focused on the relationship. She's not doing this extra stuff. I would generally like to have three to four women that are solid, that are loyal, that admire conversations and getting to know somebody. And have them come on the podcast, have them come on my YouTube channel, and we just chop it up for like 30 minutes. I would love to get their perspective on modern day relationships, modern day dating, and modern day women. I would love to get their perspective because it's not cool. Like, it's a lot of us good men out here that want a relationship. But we're afraid of women like this one in the video that are driven by money. Money is the number one priority. They don't care what type of person you are. 
They just want your money. That's it. It's not cool. So I mean it when I say that. I want to sit down. I want to talk to three to four genuine women that are not posting half naked pictures, twerking all over social media and get their perspective of modern day dating, modern day relationships and modern day women. (laughs) It's out of hand. But we're going to read some comments on this video clip from women. Yes, I said women. So it's women out here that are against what this woman is saying and don't condone this at all. The first one says, I'm really starting to see why men hate us. This is so annoying. As a woman, I'm tired of hearing this crap and seeing this selfish way of thinking. Hey, I'm not just saying this. I'm not against women. This is generally what I'm observing of modern day women. And it's not good. See, I'm not the only one that think like that. I love women, but I'm going to speak it how I see it. Another one. Every woman I have seen on the Internet in the past 24 hours has been mentally ill. I feel sorry for men. You see what I mean? That's why I say a lot of men are choosing to be single because who wants to put up with this? You know. You just want something genuine. You want a real relationship like back in the days. Healthy relationships. Where are they nowadays? Where are real people? Where is love? Social media got your head wrapped up. And it's not looking good. Because the next generation after this. It's only going to get worse. And I pray for the next generation after this. One more. The error is so delusional. How about you make a way? Having a man is bonus. This generation needs God. Um, I just really hope it gets better. I say this in every relationship, dating, video, reaction that I do. Because I genuinely want it to get better. I'm tired of friend with benefits. I'm tired of these women promoting their OnlyFans. I'm tired of it. I'm just tired of it. You know? I want to see healthy relationships. I want to see people dating and it being genuine. Not off of no, oh yeah, this person got money. I'm going to stick around. Because that's what it's like nowadays. And it's trash. I don't condone it. So, I really want to know what y'all think about this. How do y'all feel about what this woman said? Is a man supposed to work seven jobs and have two side hustles to make sure the woman gets whatever she wants? Hey, I don't know, guys. But make sure y'all subscribe to the channel. And until next time, I'm gone. Peace.